Hey guys, welcome back to another Roblox tutorial, and in this video I'm going to show you how to make a random spawn point. So the first thing we're going to want to do is go over here to the toolbox, and then go to Roblox Sets, and then Game Stuff. And here we'll get a neutral spawn point, and this is going to be where you spawn, but we're going to make it randomly move across this entire map, and all we'll have to do is set one corner and the other corner, and it will randomly spawn throughout the entire map even over this rough terrain and everything. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to delete the decal and then set the transparency to 1 and can collide to false. You don't have to use these exact settings but I think it looks pretty nice when you do it like this. So the first thing inside of here we're going to insert an object and then insert a script and then in the script we're going to define a few variables. So the local max x coordinate is going to equal 240 that would be this coordinate over here one easy way to find out where the coordinates are is to insert a part and then move it to roughly one corner of the map where you're going to have it and then look at the coordinate here 235 or it can be about I'm going to use 240 and then you can make another part and go over here to this other corner to see what the the minimum value is going to be. So back here in our script we're going to continue with this and make a local minimum x equals negative 240 then local max z equals 240 and local min z equals negative 240 and then the next thing we're going to do is set the y coordinate so local y equals I'm just going to use 2 you can make it whatever you want but for this I found 2 works pretty well and then we're going to have a math.randomseed tick and this makes it to where it's going to give us random results nearly every single time so then we're going to have a while true loop and this is going to make it uh, run repeatedly forever. So we'll say wait 0.5 and then local x equals math.random min x comma max x and this is going to give us a random value from the minimum that is defined up here minimum x negative 240 and positive 240 then we're going to have local z equals math dot random min z comma max z and then we're going to have script dot parent dot c frame equals c frame dot new x comma y comma z and then if we go ahead and hit play you notice we'll spawn in a random location and I'll go ahead and kill the player so that we can so I can demonstrate the respawning so then whenever you respawn it'll respawn us in a different location each time so that's it for this tutorial and if you enjoyed it please leave a like and thanks for watching